Okay, so this is how to tie a Portuguese bowline around two objects with a retraced bite so that you can use it for a tensioning guy. So you're going to want to measure out the length of rope you need. You're going to do a, a little loop where the top is going towards your anchors. You're going to run it through your first object, take your tail, put it down through that loop, and then you're going to take your loop, you're going to flip it over to make that snap bowline. This is called a marlin spike. You have that and it's a slip knot, so when it's time to run your rope through it again, you just pull on this running end and it will turn into a bowline. Then take your tail and run it through your second object. Make a bite. Put your bite through the loop. Put it, hold it back on itself. Pull on that running end. And there you have a bowline. Now to finish it off with that retraced bite, go underneath, over the top, and through so that all three of these strands go all the way around and through this, this bite. Make sure you have enough tail sticking out that it's not going to slip through. Now you have your Portuguese bowline around two objects and it's adjustable depending on the direction you need to guide. You'll be able to evenly distribute the load and get it just right. And then you would proceed to take this section of rope, make a loop, clip that in to your becket that you have created, run this out, clip it into uh, whatever you're anchoring, and then dog it or mule it off.